What's up guys and welcome back. In this video we're gonna be checking out the best Cydia apps for iOS 10. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right in. The first application is called Unlimited Tunes which allows you to use music as your ringtone and the text sound. So you can see here. If I open up the application, you can see a collection of music, genres and ringtones that you can. So we're going to choose here by genre and we're going to choose here randomly. If you find any song that you like, you can tap on it and tap here on the add to ringtones. When you tap, you can see that the song is now downloading. Once it's done, you can see it in the sound settings here. Go to ringtone. And if you scroll, you can see it here. You can play it to make it as a ringtone, as you can see. And also, you can see here I have added songs previously. Next up, we have Flex 3, which contains a lot of patches and tweaks that you can use to customize iOS system or applications so you can see here I have three patches here and the first one I use it to hide the carrier in the status bar and the next one is for the app the game Mario Run to bypass the jailbreak detection and next here we have uh, the dark keyboard which I use system wide in iOS and here in the cloud section you can get tweaks or patches from all your applications that you have installed on your device so for example here the camera you can see all the tweaks for the camera as you can see and also here in the app store you can have patches you can have it a patch to to block ads to have a fast download and you can search or see the popular ones here so I should mention that you are allowed to download only two tweaks per day. So if you want an unlimited download, you have to purchase the full version of Flex 3. So you can see here, I will download two patches here. The first one here for the Facebook sponsor removing. So OK. And then I'm going to download this one for YouTube application. I'm going to tap get here. So if I want to, to install the third patch, I will need to purchase the full version of like 3. So you should keep that in mind. Once you, you download any patch, make sure you turn it on in here in that section here and respring your device. Next up we have Files are, which allows you to browse all your file systems on your device from themes, tweaks and applications from the app store so you can see here the section for the tweaks and the Cydia stuff so you can see I can browse all the themes that I have installed on my device so you can see here iris I can see the icons of the theme and also you can install tweaks manually so it's a very important application here we have location faker which allows you to fake your location and put your location anywhere you want. You can see here the map is right here. Make sure you have this switch, the first switch turned on. If I search here for example any locations, for example Turkey, hit done, it will take me to Turkey. And if I go to Twitch bot for example to tweet my location, if I tap here on the location icon. So you can see here all the lo locations that are near to me in Turkey and you can tweet about your fake location. iCleaner is an app that cleans all the junk files and the unnecessary ones in your iOS device. So you can even here clean the update software and you can clean from the Safari and the App Store applications and the CDH tweaks, the sources, you can clean them, the cache files and the other stuff that you don't need so we're gonna tap here clean and see how much the app is going to clean so you can see here almost one gigabyte of unnecessary files has been cleaned and now it will automatically 
respring the device. The last but not least we have Crash Reporter which is an application that sends you notifications when you have like a crash or if you went to the safe mode it will tell you a notification what causes the problem. I have a tweak that causes the crash in the settings here so if I go to the general and the about section the settings will crash and I will receive a notification from the crash reporter that says the, cr the preference has crashed there are no suspects so in my case here I will go to the app and I will go to preference here and the date that the crash occurs and you can see here the last tweak that I've installed causes the the crash in my case here about Odid which is a tweak that allows you to show Odid number it does not support iOS 10 so as a result it causes the setting to crash so that's pretty much it guys for the best applications in Cydia I hope you enjoyed it if you did let me know by smashing that like button and subscribe if you haven't for new content thank you for watching I will talk to you in the next one